reason I do so many different let's plays, like I have a different let's play for each day. And uh, I thought maybe I should probably explain why I do that. Okay. There's so much prep time goes into recording some of these let's plays, like Dark Souls, for example. I spent about five hours upgrading my equipment, and that's five hours of playing Dark Souls. Uh, Minecraft let's plays take dozens of hours of work in between episodes, just getting the server to where you need it to be for the next episode. It, Star Trek Online will be the same in the future eventually. Um, World of Warships, I was doing my best to rank up between those each of those three videos so that I could have a different ship for each one. Didn't quite work out that way, but still, I tried. And so I'm doing a lot of recording of different pro different episodes, uh, different Let's Plays, but I'm also doing a lot of prep for each Let's Play. And um, the thing about it is, I get sick of games. I burn out of them on them very, very easily. There's very few games that have managed to hold my attention for longer than a couple of weeks and I'll always go back to them and kind of chip away with them over several months to, over a space of several months um, a great example of that would be uh, the Skyrim which I didn't finish in a single playthrough I kind of went away from it and went back to it and went away from it and went back to it because I kept burning out and I can't do that with the channel I can't do that with my YouTube channel. If I let that happen, I probably will stop recording entirely and let the, ch the channel die on the vine, basically. And I don't want that to happen. So I kind of spread my gaming out quite a bit for that reason. The other reason is I don't just game for my channel. I also game for myself. At the moment, I'm playing Destiny. I'm playing um, Bioshock 2, which is interesting. I'm working my way through Fable 2. I'm working my way through Gears of War 3. Uh, trying to think what else is there. I have to look at my list up above. Um, Final Fantasy 13. I'm working my way through that as well. And I don't want to end up in a situation where I don't want to play games because all I've been doing for days is playing games for my channel. And there's a difference in playing, because when I'm playing for myself, I'm not talking about the game or trying to hold a conversation, a one-sided conversation at that. I'm just playing. And I don't want to lose my, my love of gaming by burning out by working on my channel. Which is why I have multiple games. Because it spreads my interest, I don't get sick of a particular game. I always want to go back and play more. And I think that comes out and shows itself in my videos because I'm enthusiastic about all the games I play. Um, even Dark Souls, which is suffering and pain and anguish in digital form. So, uh, yeah, that's kind of why I do that. And I know that there are probably people that it kind of annoys a little bit because they love a particular game that I'm playing and they'd like me to do like two or three of those a week. But if I do that, my channel's not going to last because I'm not. It's not going to hold my attention. I'm going to get sick of it. I'm going to burn out. I'm going to quit, and I'm not going to let that happen. It doesn't it just does not work that way for me? So that's why I'm doing this. It's also why I have so many other side projects running as well. I guess I don't exactly get bored easily, but my attention kind of gets taken up by other things quite easily. Anywho, that's that for today. I will be back to you on Sunday. Tomorrow, Dark Souls, uh, more Blight Town, but good Blight Town. And uh, Saturday, Diablo 2, first episode, I think, in the new area, Luz Golain. Luz Golain. Uh, it's based on Arabia. And uh, yeah, that's it. So I will talk to you all again soon. Have a great day, and bye for now.